What's going on guys, it's John with GoWesty and today I'm going to show you how to install the LED glove box light. As always for safety, please disconnect your battery before beginning any electrical work in your vehicle. You're going to start by removing the glove box from the van and the glove box mounting plate. Carefully grab some scissors and the instruction sheet and find a nice, quiet place to cut out the template for drilling the switch mounting holes. Transfer the hole location from the template to the bracket with a permanent marker. You can use a punch to indent the drill location. Then drill the holes to 330 seconds. Mount the switch with the provided hardware with the actuator arm facing away from the plate back and the white roller cam down. Before we put the mounting plate back on, peel off the sticker from the far left mounting hole and scrape away a bit of paint to reveal a clean metal as this will be the light's ground connection. Mount the plate back into position with the switch ground ringlet between the plate and the vehicle body. Now we'll affix the light to the dash. Run the light along with the wiring behind any wires or hoses behind the glove box and use the alcohol prep pad to clean the inner lip of the dash above the glove box opening. Remove the backing from the 3M adhesive and firmly press the light into place. Be sure the wire exits the inboard side of the glove box opening so that the LEDs emit their light downward. Next, split the black and red wires to about 2 inches from the end of the light strip and use the included clip with adhesive backing to hold the wires out of the way. There's a dash support bar just inboard the opening that works best for clip mounting location. Now, run the red wire over to the map light to pick up power. I like to use small dabs of super glue to keep the ground wire kept nice and tidy behind the glove box. While this isn't a must, I strongly recommend doing it. Now gently pry the map light from the dash and unplug the red power wire. Cut the connector from the end and strip about a half inch of this wire and the red LED wire and crimp them together in the supplied insulated yellow female connector. Reconnect this to the map light and snap the map light back into the dash. Reinstall the glove box, hook up the battery that you made sure to disconnect in the beginning of this endeavor, and enjoy some automated light in your glove box.